going on guys, it's Avery from Avery Gaming and welcome back to Offcam. Today, I generally couldn't be bothered downloading anything, I'll say, I'll admit it. But, that wasn't the reason why I brought on Offcam. As I used to say a lot, Offcam is a series where I used to, I'm not going to lie, I'm pretty sure I, I'll say this for honest, earnest, I used to take pride in Offcam. Offcam was one of those that... When you knew it was not working, it would still be a nice little game to, nice little uh, run to have, due to Ofcam's nature. Ofcam wasn't a sponsored series or anything like that, it was just a series where I could either fix up stuff and just talk like I'm doing now, or organize stuff and talk. It was more to, as it, as it stated there, it's more to do with talking than actually worrying about anything. So let's actually go on to that topic. A lot of people in the world, no matter who you are or where you're from, where you come from, oh gosh, it's always the same you always fear that one day a secret or something you don't want people to know will be shown and it's gonna you feel like it's gonna ruin your life but then there's the cases where you feel like if you don't that's gonna make your life worse it, it's quite controversial this topic so bear in mind it's not history of it, it's more off cam so it's just random gibberish so it's my opinion when I was young when I was younger I used to I don't know why I'm saying this but I used to always always love watching horror films but one thing caught up to me in time I used to never like watching the film twice. Bear in mind, watching it once, a horror film, while well, at the age of eight years old. Don't know how I managed it, but I managed it. But it was more of, I didn't know how to process the horror films. The approach to scary, but they process them as normal. Because in my family, if you watch a horror film, that's normal. Like, you don't get afraid of horrors. In my family, we specialize in loving horrors. It's... It's one of those things we love doing. And... Sadly, it became like a tradition now. We were, when my brothers got girlfriends, or when my brother, yeah, when my brothers got girlfriends, and one's married, one of the things our family really does look out for is how well they can handle their horror. As much as my brothers don't want to admit it, it's true. Wrong way. And my brothers are too scared in case something happens. All my brothers, including my most annoying brother, but we all love horrors. It's a common denominator in our house. Horror is like, for us, I know this is going to sound weird, isn't it? but horror for us, it's like, um, we're off to go and see, I don't know, What's big? We're off to go and see another Disney film. That's how much we all love horrors. But due to certain natures of certain not of some of us, we go off wanting to use a watch horrors. But that's only because either we're trying to impress someone, which is kind of sleazy. Don't get me wrong. I even admit that. Or we're trying to find out what that person wants or try and work out something 
that's the only times we don't watch horrors when it's something for us to gain if we can't gain anything from it and it's to do with a horror film don't get me wrong it's not going to be worth our time and I'm pretty sure you'll see our faces do the typical anime thing and just go ugh I can't believe you just made me do that so it generally is weird saying this myself because I know full well that I actually really do love horrors all the time any day, any time, any day, I love horrors. At one stage, I got my friends to go come over and watch a horror. We actually found it was terrible. I'm not joking. She actually was like, ugh, this horror is actually quite bad. It was, in, lay in layman's terms, if you've ever watched the film, um, I don't know what it's called now. Paranormal, not paranormal activity. I'm trying to think what the film's called. If you ever watch the film, uh, I can't remember what it's called. It's like a documentary. I think it might be actually called Paranormal Activity. By the way, I was just playing on my mobile game at the same time as I'm rushing this morning. But, yeah, anyhow, before I do take too long and this episode goes way longer than I expected it, hopefully you guys have enjoyed today's episode. If you have, please leave a like, comment, and subscribe. If you haven't, I'm sorry, as I always say. Can't do much about that, it generally is my fault, probably, because I'm the one creating the episodes. You guys are just watching, I'm creating, so as the creator, it's up to my response. So, on behalf of me, I'm sorry. And by the way, don't get me wrong, I'm not humble. I'm just honest. So, on that note, I'll see you guys all next time. Bye.